<laughs> Taking out trees. Sorry, family. Here we go. So what are we doing today, Waylon? Uh, today we're just mudding and having a good time. <laughs> so the buggy's back together. It's running pretty good. Since we, since the last video, I've had to figure out getting the cooling system working. Turned out it was just really annoying to bleed, so that's fixed. Otherwise, about the same as last time I drove it. Head gaskets are holding still. Installed some new gauges because the old temperature gauge wasn't working. And one thing we need to do before we really send it is put an oil pump in it because the oil pressure is a little low. But you'll have that on these big jobs. <laughs> Should we get a reaction video today too? Yeah, sure. Drive fast, take chances. <laughs> Let's take her for a rip. Come on, you. Is it open? Make sure this. So it's gotta be like that when it goes through. Yeah. And then it clicks down, you can feel it. Yeah. Heck yeah, baby.
That was a blast. How was that? Oh, sweet. <laughs> Ready to do it again. So what we learned from that scientific experiment is that this still needs some fine tuning. I was told when I first built this that the carburetor would be problematic when you're going up steep inclines. And that's definitely the case, but it was still fun. Oh, did you have fun? Yeah, I had a blast. Craziest thing I've done in my entire life right here. <laughs> Look at this thing. So, um, in the next few weeks, we're going to have to put an oil pump in it. Hopefully, that's the reason it has low oil pressure and it's not the bearings. We'll see. And I got a bigger rad coming for it for keeping the temps down. Plenty of fun things to do with this thing. So, hopefully, you enjoyed that video. And uh, we'll be back with another soon with this thing. Comment what you want to see what us do with this. What I was thinking of doing was putting really short tires on it and a handbrake and turning it into a drift buggy. <laughs> I can see, imagine. That'd be fun. Yeah. Also, the transmission turns out it's blown. So I bought this as a package deal out of an old Blazer. And that guy that I bought it from had never driven it. And it turns out third gear is gone. Mm. And reverse is not happy right now either. So she needs some love, but it'll get there. So thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Drive fast, take chances. <laughs> <laughs>